Sensley, I need your help. What is it? I'm trying to watch some TV here. Which one looks more Canadian to you? Um, I've never been to Canada, but I'm pretty sure they dress the same as us. Well, according to the internet, they like sparkles and dogs. So, which one looks more doggish to you? Um, Kenny, that is the dumbest thing you have ever asked me. And you've asked me a lot of dumb things in our lifetime. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with the plaid. Thanks for your help. What are you doing? I'm picking an outfit out for Clara Diamond's party. What are you wearing? Well, I'm not wearing anything to her party because we're not going, remember? Oh, I forgot to tell you my plan, didn't I? Yeah, I think you did. Well, all we have to do is just sneak out of the house. I mean, your mom doesn't have to know we're going anywhere. No, we did that once before, remember the dress? Yeah, I remember, and it went fine. Um, we ended up scrubbing the floors for two weeks. Oh, it wasn't that bad. Yeah, because you got to feed Tatum grapes all day long. Yeah, she has bad breath. Anyway, come on. I'll help you pick out an outfit. Don't worry, it doesn't have to be this way. You know what? This could work. Okay. Why not? I like to bite my nails and play the air guitar. I like to keep my suitcase packed cause I'm going far. Girls, are you sure you're going to be okay? Yes, Mom, we're fine. Well, I had no idea that you girls liked the Three Stooges. Well, Miss Snecker, then if we didn't like it, what's the point of staying up to three in the morning watching the marathon? Oh, well, you do have a point. You know you don't have to stay up all night. If you get tired, you can go to bed. Yes, Mom, we know we're not three-year-olds anymore. Oh. And one more thing. If you need anything at all, don't bother me. I'm going to be in La La Land. Either tell your sister or try to handle it yourself. Okay? We're all good. Good night, girls. Oh, and by the way, I'm really proud of you girls. You could have stayed mad at me for as long as you wanted, but you decided to just deal with it. I trust you girls now. Thank you. Well, Mom, you know, you're just trying to do the right thing by doing by. Being a good parent, I mean, we understand. All those paparazzis that are going to be there, that is definitely not the place for an 8th grader. I'm glad you girls understand. And by the way, don't go throw any wild parties while I'm sleeping again. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> she trusts us. <laughs> are you sure about this? Don't worry. I put an extra sleeping pill in her bedtime drink. If we're lucky, we can get there and back before it wears off. Okay, let's wait a few minutes before she falls asleep. Good idea. Do you want to change the channel? Yeah, how about that? Tinsley? Tinsley, wake up. We're going to go now. Okay, okay, I'm up. Okay, let's get this over with. Okay, do I look okay? Yes, you look beautiful. Aw, thanks. Okay, let's go out the basement door. Isn't that the only way out from the basement? Okay, let's just go. Ashley, this Pepsi is fabu, isn't it? Um, right. Hey, Allie, do you think you know when denim jeans are going to be here? I'm kind of excited about seeing them. Why are you excited about seeing them? <sighs> They're not going to be here. We made sure of it at school, remember? Oh, hey, girls. They shouldn't be coming. Oh, 
Um, hi Clara. <laughs> yeah. Hi Clara. I'm so glad you could make it. Do any of you know where denim jeans are? I need to thank them for being my guests of honor. Um, right. I don't think they're going to be here tonight. Yeah, they're not going to be here at all. Shh. Um, Ashley, how about you go do something? Are you sure? But they said that they would come. I know how disappointed you are, though. I'm sure that they'll be here. Oh my gosh, Kenley, this place is so amazing. Everything's so perfect. I know, right? It's all pink and purple and zebra. Definitely a Clara Diamond party. Oh look, Becca's here. Hey, Becca. Hi, Becca. Hey. Oh. Um, hey, denim jeans. Oh, Becca, are you okay? Do you have a cold? What? Why would you ask that? I'm fine. Oh, your voice. It just kind of sounds a little strange. No offense or anything. Oh, uh, none taken. Um, Becca, aren't you a vegetarian? And if so, why are you holding a hot dog? Oh, um, this isn't my hot dog. I'm holding it for a friend, so, huh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, you might want to go get your friend another one. Mm, okay, I'm just gonna go now. Bye. Well, she was acting kind of strange. Nah, I wouldn't take it too personally. Now, let's go find Clara. <gasps> Kinsley! Kennedy! Over here! Over here! Hey, Clara! Oh my gosh, I can't believe you made it! Yep, we did, but it wasn't easy, though. Well, now that you're here, we can have cake and snacks. Cool. We'll be right there, Claire. Okay, I have to go get my CDs for the DJ. I'll be right back. Uh, Kennedy, I just smeared some of my makeup off on my eye. I'm going to go touch it up in the bathroom, okay? Oh, I'll come with you. Fine by me. Let's go. Whoa. Hello, girls. We've got to go find Claire now. Oh, I wasn't supposed to put her, was I? 